My name is Tom Marshall. I'm a 2023 graduate. I play at Brooklyn Casey High School. I'm a catcher utility and I'm committed to Clemson University and this is what is in my bag. So first, I'm gonna start out with in the backpack I carry around everywhere. Start off with the gloves. Bruce Bolt gloves. These are the best possible gloves you can get. I have the like kind of boxing straps you can get and I feel like on my wrist it's really supportive and like it it's they're really comfortable. They're leather and they lasted me a while. I think the last pair I had lasted me about six months until the start of uh, summer ball. And in here I got a pro hitter. Had a pro hitter for about a year. Got used to it and now I can never hit without of it without it. I just it it keeps the bat in my fingertips and it feels really good. Next on to my arm sleeve. I get so much crap for this arm sleeve, but I've had it for a while. I think I have like two pairs. One night I was like just thinking about it and then I went downstairs and cut a soccer sock and created the wonderful arm sleeve. Next, I got my extra pair of lenses that 100% sent me with uh, the glasses I got. I got the clear versions and then uh, like a gray smoky version. I'll put the clears in if I'm playing at like, like a night complex, I'm playing at night at like a complex or I just don't feel like wearing regular sunglasses and I just wanna see clear. Next to the gloves, this right here, All Star 33, I think, or 34 inch. Uh, one of the best possible mitts you can get on the market right now. I think I've had it for about a year and a half. What I love about it is it's really easy to break in. I think it took me about three days to break in, and um, I, I've, it's, it's lasted me a long, a long time. And I wanted to get the black version because everybody everybody else I saw at All Star had the tan and black version. So I just wanted to be different and get the black one. And then this right here, this is a savior for me. It's a, a All Star wrist guard and it really is for support for me. So if I like catch a ball off like the, the webbing, it, my mitt doesn't come off. And it's, it's at the second time it's uh, protective. So I really like that. Now to the, my infield glove, I got a Rawlings Heart of the Hide, 12 inch. Me and my dad picked this up at a Rawlings store in case I ever needed to get, or my coach ever played me out, me out in the field. I could just go out there with this. It's a, you can use that third infield, outfield. One of the best gloves you can possibly get. On to the bat. Let's draw for my bat. Start off with the metal I use. I use uh, the 2021 33 Demarine the Goods. In my opinion, it's the best BB core bat you can get. It's the sweet spot isn't big, but when you catch a hold of it on the sweet spot, you, the ball is going to be hit very hard. And I like the feel of it. I like the alloy part. I used to use composite, but I fell in love with the alloy when I used the goods. For my wood bats, this bat right here lasted me all summer. One of the best bats or wood bats that I've ever used. It's the Kyle Schwarber Louisville Slugger version. Uh, I like uh, what I like about it is the thick handle. Just so put a really small, uh, thin grip on it, and it just feels really good in your hands. Another thing I really like about this is how big the barrel is. It just feels like every ball you swing at, you can put a barrel on.
my next wood bat. This is what I started out with in the summer, Chandler by far, besides the Louisville. The Chris Bryant version, one of the best wood bat brands you can possibly get. Very hard wood and it sounds really good when you hit it, especially in the sweet spot. And again, like the Louisville Slugger, it's got a really big barrel. Feels like every ball you swing at, you catch a barrel on. Start off with my helmets. I'm a switch hitter, so I got two of them with the chin guards. This is my uh, travel team helmets, Mizuno. Really comfortable and I like the white. One of my guards, I got my left-handed pieces. Got an elbow guard and then a leg guard. I like it a lot, especially when you roll over on your foot and it hits off the guard and it, it doesn't hurt. Especially with the elbow guard, you get up and in, you just turn and it it bounces right off. And I got my righty one that I use in the rare times I hit right-handed. Then my cleats, I got uh, Nike Reacts. These are my team cleats for high school and then I just decided to use them for travel ball. Really comfortable cleats. Um, the spikes, they've done me good. They haven't really doled down and I just like the feel of them. On my gear, I use All Star gear. Again, All Star, the best catching company you can get your gear at. Super comfortable. It just feels like when you put on your gear, it's like it fits like a glove. It just forms right to your body, and it's really tight and close. And it, the ball bounces off your chest. It, you don't feel anything. And the shin guards are really comfortable, especially the new uh, technologies they're putting in, like cushion in the knees and right on top, like the bottom of the knee, it's really comfortable so your knees aren't hurting after like a really long day of catching. You know, I got, got my slide in it, even though sometimes I don't run, I use it. I broke my finger a couple of years ago when I slid in a second, someone stepped on it and this has done me good. People, sometimes I get stepped on, so good protection for the hand. And she's got a couple of baseballs in here. You know, you never know when you're gonna need any, especially if you're a catcher and you pitcher doesn't have a ball, warm up with them with a the ball. Always have balls on you. Feels good in your fingertips and the barrel is just big big and long. 